I know. Hi, Gemma. How are you? I know people that start my lives after they've already been posted are like, this bitch just sits there and doesn't say anything. Yay, Mindy. How are you? I'm at the gym doing upper body. Yes. Good for you. I just got, I don't have it yet. Adam's bringing it. It's at the house. Uh, I just got the mini stepper, the little bitty one with the resistance bands to do in the truck. I'm so excited. Thank you guys for coming over here. I want to be at the gym doing upper body, but I'm going to do my workouts in the truck because we're not home enough for me to have a gym membership. It doesn't make any sense. So I'm pretty excited about that. My videos are going to be so much better now that I have an iPhone. I'm so excited about it because I can actually stand and look at myself in this camera. The other camera, oh my God, is horrible. The Do you still have your house or do you both just live in the truck? Adam has a house, but I'm not allowed to be around his kids, which I explained that in my video that I just posted, my new video. And since I can't be around his kids, I just stayed, he brought me to the truck and I'm staying in the truck, which is like a little studio apartment what happened to my home? I relapsed and was addicted to crack and I had to go to rehab. So my lease was up and they weren't going to renew my lease because I was behind on my rent. So, uh, I just gave it up basically. So Adam has a house and Eventually things will work out and I'll be able to be around his kids, but right now I can't so and that's fine Is the truck yours or Adams? The truck is Adams Yes But it's really like it's such a mess in here right now and I don't know how to turn the camera around Okay, let me show you guys So there's a bed up there There's all of our stuff I'm washing the bedding right now for this bed. There's my backpack with all my hygiene in it. There's the refrigerator, coffee pot, microwave, storage, cabinet stuff. There's all of my clean laundry I just did. And God forbid you don't break up, but if you did, what would happen? To you would you be homeless i'm worried about you Mindy. no i wouldn't be homeless don't worry i promise you i wouldn't be homeless i mean not at all i have places that i could go and if oh if if we did break up i would probably go back to sober living hi nicole beige doesn't age i'm dead <laughs> I was crying when you said that. Oh my God. I love you too, Nicole. Beige don't age and black don't crack. I was dying. Okay, I'm Native American, so we got some good genes too. So I know I'm, I look white, but I'm not. That truck looks so comfortable. It is comfortable and it's not that bad. I was really worried about today because I didn't want to feel like I, cause I can't be around his kids and I didn't know what I was going to do and I'm not seeing my kids until tomorrow. Girl, you are gorgeous. Oh, thank you so much. My nationality is German and Native American. So I didn't know what I was going to do besides hang out in the truck. I mean, cause I can't go around any of the old people I used to hang around, right? People, places, things. So this is the best place for me. It is because I'm staying out of trouble. I could have had somebody from my past come pick me up and I could have went and got high. You know what I'm saying? So I am okay with sitting in this truck and waiting for him to come pick me up and go home when his kids go back. Girl, I'm black. 
Caribbean, Caribbean, and that comment had me laughing when Nicole said, I was dying. She is funny. She is fucking hilarious. Hey, Brandon's Recovery. How are you? I'm half Filipino, Asian, don't raisin. <laughs> One of my, my roommate is Asian, my ex-roommate. She's Asian, and she looks hella young. I think she doesn't age at all. Just hang out and be good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Nicole. That's what I'm doing. I'm being good. Because you know that it would be really easy for me to be bad right now if I was on that kind of time. I could get picked up with the quickness and be right back on the shit. But I'm serious about my recovery this time. Like, we're doing big fucking things. I'm going to quit vaping, too. I really am. Promise. Nicole and Minnie love them both and so proud of them both. Thank you. Is it Nikia? Is that how you say it? Nikia? I don't know how to say it. Did I pronounce it right? And I'm not as good at lives as Nicole. Nicole knows what to say. She keeps you entertained all the time. Nick Nick, I don't know how to say it. Nicola, Nick, Nick, I don't know how to say it. One thing at a time, get a good six months, then try to quit babying. Good idea. You are a natural born entertainer, girl. You're fucking hilarious. I love watching your lives. Like, I don't really watch anybody else's lives. I just don't. But my notification goes off. It says discovering Nicole's going live. And I jump off my live. I'm like, Nicole's going live. Everybody get off my live and go to Nicole's live. Because I fucking love watching you. Nick, hi, yeah. Nick, I, yeah. Nikaya? Nikaya? Nikaya. I want you to come stay the night so we can laugh all day. I know, we should have a slumber party. Oh my God, it would be so fun. Nakaya. Okay, good, I got it. I'm so glad, because it was really pissing me off that I couldn't say it. Um, Nicole, I made my first video. You gotta go watch it. We would laugh so hard, we would be peeing. I know, I was just talking about, on my last live, I was talking about how, like, with age, or being in this truck, something has happened to me where I cannot hold my pee. Like, I don't feel it coming on. And when I have to go, I have to go right now or I'm going to piss my pants. And it's really hard being in this truck because we can't just get off any exit and go to a gas station. We have to go to a truck stop. So, it's a mess. <laughs> like, I, if I was at Nicole's house and we were laughing, I would piss my pants. I really would. Nicole is funny. You should hear our, you should hear us on the phone, our conversations. Oh my God. After one kid, I can barely hold my pee. Laugh out loud, I feel ya. It, it just hit me. I mean, I think it's because I'm not drinking water. I think it's got something to do with my kidneys. Brandon, I don't know you, but I hope you are okay. I saw your comment about relapsing. Don't be hard on yourself. What did Brandon say about relapsing? I didn't see it. We wake up at 7 a.m. and are on the phone dying laughing. If that's not the truth. Every morning. At least we both get up early. <laughs> Nicole's the first person I call. And then Brenda. I'm like, but Nicole, as soon as I wake up, on the phone with Nicole. We are early birds. We are. And Paco is a fucking trip. When, I don't know if you guys saw Nicole's video when she's like driving to go mail the stuff and then she's like, the camera turns to the back seat and she's like, what did you say? What'd you call him? Paco riding in the car cracks me up. My co-host. Is my co-host back there? And Paco's just chilling. My co-host, it was so funny. He said he relapsed not long ago. Brandon, you relapsed not long ago? I didn't see that comment. Are you okay now? I am fresh off a of relapse. So you just gotta pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and keep it pushing, bro. About a month or two ago. I'm sorry, are you okay now? 
what's your drug of choice? Paco and SJ need a sleepover. They do because they're going to be besties like me and Nicole. They are. <laughs> and he's sitting front and center. Just fucking sitting there. Just chilling. Not moving around. Nothing. Just sitting there. Like literally like her co-host. It was so funny. For about two weeks straight. Heroin. Well, I love you, Nicole. Thanks for coming. Brandon, I'm glad that you're back. He is a boss. Yes, he is. I'm glad that you're back, Brandon. Are you doing okay now? Heroin, I... Okay, bye. Love you. Tell Neil I said hi. I've never done heroin, and I'm glad that I never tried it because I have such an addictive personality. I'm sure that I would have got hooked on it, and I'm positive that I am not strong enough to go through those withdrawals, so that I don't know it probably would have killed me. For now, I am. If you ever need someone to talk to, Brandon email me. Have you emailed me before? Haven't you emailed me? Heroin is a beast. Crack is a beast, bro. I don't know. There's like, I don't know. I've never, like I said, I've never tried heroin. I have tried fentanyl though. Uh, not on purpose, but I did try it and thankfully I didn't like it. I did not like it. The only thing that I liked about it was, yeah, you emailed me, but I never heard back from you again. Email me and I'll give you my phone number. What are the chances that Adam is sweet enough and thoughtful enough and remembers that my banana cake vape is almost gone and he stops and gives me one? Have you done any overseas travel? No, I have not. I've never flown overseas. I've been to like, have I ever flown overseas? No, I've never flown overseas. Just all over the United States and Mexico and where else have I been? That's about it. You have, you have emailed me and I gave you my phone number, Brandon. Email me again and I'll give you my new phone number because I got a new phone. I ho I've been to the Bahamas. I've heard the Bahamas are so beautiful. I would love to go there. Would love it. Did you ever travel to any place interesting during modeling? No, no place interesting, just in the United States. Like, one time I was about to go somewhere and my parents wouldn't let me go. I can't remember where it was, but they wouldn't let me because they wouldn't pay for my mom to go, so I wasn't able to go. So the one time when I was going to start being able to travel, like, around you know, someplace else in the world, and my parents wouldn't let me go because I was only 15. And then the rest of the time, I just stayed in the United States. Um, hi, Wednesday. How are you? Um, did you guys watch my first video that I posted for my new channel? And I'm going to change my channel name. Since I sold my TikTok account, I'm keeping it for seven days so that people can catch up with my video and catch my YouTube name and subscribe. I was just in the Bahamas for my honeymoon. It was gorgeous, but we didn't get to spend a lot of time there because it was a cruise. I would go again for sure. Oh, I bet that was fun. That sounds like a lot of fun. Um, I've been on a cruise, so I guess, I mean, that's not overseas. I've been on a couple cruises. And I didn't really like them. Like, it just wasn't my thing. Hey, Brandon. Got it. I don't know my phone number. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to email you this number real quick. And then I'll give you my new number after I get off the phone. But I'm going to give you this number so you can text me. So that I don't forget.
I'm doing it now. And you fucking text me before you do anything dumb. If you're feeling some type of way, I better hear from you. I just sent you my number. It's this phone, and then I will give you my new phone number because I don't know it. But now you've got this phone number, so send me a text. Okay? And I do care. And before you do anything dumb, you call me or you text me, and I will talk you off the ledge, I promise. Because there's just no use going down that road again. Having to go through withdrawals again and all that shit. Why do that? Mindy, I love your shorts. I'm a Scorpio sun rising, so I relate so much. Thank you. I appreciate that. It It's hard. Like, now that I don't have TikTok, I don't know what to do. Because it, it's just easier to manipulate and make videos on TikTok. I'm going to have to figure out how to do it with the YouTube shorts. I've tried reaching out to Nicole and she never answered. Oh, are you sure? Do you have her right phone number? Because I know Nicole. Hey, Ash. I know Nicole talks to so sure. She gives her phone number to everybody and I know she tries to respond to everybody. So you should try her again, but definitely text me. I'm currently in Mumbai, India traveling. Really want a drink, but not sure it's safe. And my hotel doesn't have alcohol. Fuck my life. <laughs> well, safe travels. I hope you're having a good time. Minnie's awesome. She answers comments and emails. Thank you, Alex. How does SJ use the bathroom in the truck? So we we stop often and take him potty at truck stops or whatever. Does he give you a sign or yeah, he licks. He starts licking. I'm not gonna hold it over her head. I understand. No, I get it. She just, uh, I know she gives her number out to everybody and she probably maybe just missed it because she really responds to everybody. So she had to have just missed it. She's really good about that. And so am I. I give my number to everybody and I will talk to you all day if you need to because I'm just sitting here. David Thompson sent you a friend request. Who's that? Let's see. SJ just turned five. He just turned five. Well, I don't know who this is, but we can be friends, I guess. I accepted the friend request. I don't know who the fuck it is. Hmm. Y'all both are the best with talking to your supporters. Thank you. I appreciate that. Hold on one second. Um, what a cutie. I was going to say, if he was a puppy, you should teach him some cool tricks. Oh, I'm about to teach him some cool tricks. I'm going to, he's going to be featured in my TikToks. I mean, my YouTubes. Um, so anyway, sorry about that. Well, you guys, I think I'm going to work on some stuff in the truck and, um, I'm going to hop off of here. So I love you guys. Uh, Brandon, text me.
and I will see you guys later. Go watch my first video that I posted if you haven't already, and I love you. Mwah. Bye.